Look at these dudes. Okay, so this this is gonna be ow, not ow, but you stick my hand in the nail polish. But we're gonna be doing an unboxing of the knives that I ordered. Um, this order cost me just under thirty dollars because of the sale and discount codes. Oh yeah. All right. Item one of three. Oh yes. Ooh, this is the life blade one. All right, this this is the life blade. I'm gonna put that one away. So this should be the trainer. Tis. Spring latch. It's really nice. It's a little bit stiffer than I would imagine. Fuck. All right, um, I'm gonna move on to the free thing that I got as long, along with the order, mini ball song. Not very sure. No, 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 Wait, pause. That's it. That's the night. It's so small! Uh, I'm gonna try to do a Zen rollover. Uh, I don't think it's gonna work. Nope, take this trainer back out. I'd be very intimidated by this um, if someone walked up to me and yeah, it's um, it's really smooth. It's got a very stiff feel though. And this is the live blade casting yeah, is. Definitely, um, not going to be use this for a little bit, um, because, like, I don't want to cut my fingers off. Um, I'm going to set that aside. But, uh, the trainer. Um, the trainer feels heavier than the live blade. But yeah, um, really, really good looking knives. Move my light. Oh shit, did we not mention that all these knives that you are seeing are both real life renditions of blades from CSGO? They are. That's it open. This is closed. It's really, it's really great looking. Though I did want the Galaxy skin. Uh, yeah, these are CSGO inspired by the way. Uh oh. Uh oh. Um. But now that I have these, I'm going to be uploading, well, we, uh, me and my friend, we're going to be uploading how-to videos. Let me, let me show you a quick draw real quick. Just, this is definitely going to take some getting used to because of the curve. But safe handle. I'm going to hold between these two. I'm going to go up. Put your thing, fingers down. Go down. Open up your thumb. Up. And that's the quick jar opening. And then to close it, it and have your blade facing down and go up so that the blade, the back of the blade is resting on the back of your hand. Down over your knuckles and then into your hand. 
No. I'd have to say this thing. It's very, very fascinating to look at it. It's very shiny. Um, something you'd probably give your kid. Um, you know, if you ever want them to become a Bala Song extraordinaire. The, the latch is very, very crummy. Like, latch just drops. Speaking of latch drops, this thing does not have enough momentum. I'll show you the latch drop with this. This is definitely going to have to be broken in. It's still really stiff. Yeah, just, I don't know, it just feels weird. Doesn't exactly feel the best either. I keep grabbing the wrong handle. To remember that the inside handle, the inside of the scoop is the safe handle. Yeah, other than that, um, yeah, like I said, spring latch. You press it in, springs open, close it, close the latch, yeah, it stays open. And I like the spring latches because when you're doing tricks, they stay out of the way. <laughs> wow. Yeah, like I said, these things, they've got an awkward grip. You know, they... Just not as fluent as you would expect a ball song to be. Um, that's really all I've got to say. But um, again, the live blade, um, the latch, definitely a lot firmer. Having a hard time opening the spring latch. It's a lot firmer on the one with the blade. You know, I just just want to show you this. Let's slide that up. I'm just gonna just goes right there. You massacred my boy. It's a nice blade. Um, I'm gonna have to do something about the firmness of the latch because it feels way too tight. See, now opening it, it's just fine when it's closed, but when it's open, it's really firm. Um, that that really concludes my review. Um, if you want to get these, you can go on bladecity.com. Um, they have other um, really great looking knives that are outside of my pay zone. And uh, I, I just really encourage you to go use Blade City. Um, use the code CART10 for 10% off your purchase. Um, that's really all I can tell you. Ah! I just pinched myself. Not even off the blade. God. It was right in there. I think, no. I don't even know how I did that. Yeah, I was doing the basic open and crush my fingers. Um, I'd say that if you want to get into Bala songs, um, definitely start off with a trainer because these really feel different compared to other Bala songs. You know, the regular straight ones. But they're, they're really great looking knives and they look really flashy and intimidating. So if you're just going for intimidation, 
Because some flash it like of a CSGO knife. But That doesn't mean we condone attacking people on the street with CSGO knives. If you're looking for doing tricks, um, it might be impressive to do with the CSGO ones. But it's a lot easier to use straight ones. So, yeah. Um, yeah, that, that, that concludes. I'd give these... 9 out of 10, because they just, uh, they just, kind of firm. Yeah, that, that concludes my review. So yeah, um, I'm going to practice using the live blade. Um, God, I really don't, I really hope I don't cut myself. Um, yeah. Trying Zen rollout with CSGO knife. I'm, I'm gonna go practice with the trainer. I really don't feel like cutting my fingers off today. Not bad. Like I said, really smooth but really firm at the same time. Like, I don't know, it's just. It's really great. But really not great. Yeah, look at me. <laughs> and back to the mini knife. Not something I would ever, ever pay money for. But, ow, oh, starting to bleed. The latch is too long. There's wobbling, it just comes right out. It sounded it just looks like something that I would scrape my nails with. Can't even. It's got an okay blade for how small it is. Look at that. With, with it being open, look at how much space there is. Between where the ac latch actually is and where the end of the handle is. It's just, uh, I mean, cheap Chinese building. You know, like I said, it's free with a purchase on Blade City, so it was good, you know, for it being free. Um, gonna have to label these boxes, because there's, there's no distinction on these. It just says, made in China, and it... it you know, Live blade. I'll put that away. Back to the trainer. Can't even really latch drop right because, like, handles are uneven. Like. So latch strap is a definite no-no. And I'm sure with how stupid I'm acting with this, uh, if I had the live blade, I would have cut myself several times. Um, yeah, that, that's basically it. Um, yeah, I'd give the trainer and blade set good 9 out of 10 and the free mini blade a 6 out of 10 just cuz the latch doesn't you know really work but yeah, um that that's really all I have for this time um the next video I personally am going to be making is either another trick video or a, another knife review because I have a sharpener coming in that I got a free mystery knife with so watch out for that bye
Thank you guys for getting to the end of this video. I hope you liked it. I took a bit of more time editing it than usual. Hope everything got across and you liked the review and still learned something from it, hopefully. Man, it took almost all day for me to edit. I realized that tomorrow I'm gonna be getting my galaxy knives. Yeah, yeah, the knives that you wanted, Aiden. Yeah, I'm getting them, they're coming, yeah. I'll let you, I'll let you check around with it, but it's just a trainer. But either way, thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Love you. Bye.